Hey guys, this is Drake from Spiffy Empire. I'm uh, sorry about the quality of this video. I've had uh, some problems with my recording software. I'll try to get them fixed up for the uh, next tutorial. Anyway, uh, this tutorial is to show you how to make a first-person controller, which is used in uh, many first-person games these days, like Call of Duty and Battlefield. Although they're not coded in the Unity engine, they follow the same kind of uh, concept. So anyway, if you're uh, thinking about making your own uh, first-person shooter in Unity, here's how you can uh, create your controller. So I'm going to make a platform for us to stand on first. I'm going to go up here to Terrain, and I'm going to uh, select Terrain. I mean, uh, create Terrain, sorry about that. And I'm going to select, uh, set the resolution to 100 by 1... Oops, sorry about that. 100. And uh, now we have a fairly small platform. Now simply go up here into the project bar. Make sure you've imported the uh, first person controller asset or just the whole standard assets package. So I'm going to type in first and I'm going to drag first person controller into the scene view. I'm going to come down here and I'm going to lift it up. And uh, that looks pretty good. Now you can simply just press play and walk around and you can see up in the scene view that it seems to be working fine. Now I'm going to take it one step further for this tutorial and I'm going to show you how to add a prop into the, or a model into the main camera. So when you walk around you can essentially point at stuff. This would be helpful if you're making a first person shooter as you can tie the weapon that you're holding to your camera. So, I'm going to get a prop here. I'm just going to use a uh, fence, I guess. And I'm just going to drag that right into view. And uh, now, first of all, I want to pull it up towards my uh, thing here. I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees. There, that looks about good. Now, uh, what I want to do here is I want to tie the fence to the main camera. Now the main camera is what you're seeing out of here in the game view, so whenever I move the main camera, the fence will move as well as you, well as what happens in a Call of Duty or Battlefield game. So I'm going to drag that into the main camera, and whenever I press play, and I move around, the fence is attached to my camera. So uh, guys, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Uh, come back later, I will have, well I will hopefully have better recording software and I'll have more Unity 3D tutorials. Uh, anyway guys, thank you very much. Please check out some of our vi other videos and uh, overall just have a nice day.